Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. And uh, I wanted to say a big, big thank you. Thank you guys for this very nice journey. I was able to reach a couple of days ago to thousand subscribers. Uh, and it's just, uh, you know, so, so huge. I know that it's not much, you know, compared to other channels or, uh, you know, uh, stuff like that. But uh, as you guys know, I have this channel as a hobby. That's why, by the way, I, I almost never edit my videos. They're always like raw as I just record them. Um, and I know that, you know, the content I have on this channel is very different. That's why the channel grows uh, much more slowly. But at the same time, you know, I just want to say you that I'm having a lot of fun. I'm having a lot of fun, you know, recording, uploading uh, the videos, uh, you know, showing the workouts or doing cover songs or sharing some apologetics, you know, or some meditations from the Bible. It's something that uh, has been, you know, it's fun for me. It's something that I enjoy doing and that's why I'm doing it. So I just want to say a big thank you. You know, thank you for all the, all the support, all the comments, all the feedback. Uh, I, I appreciate each one of your comments, especially when they are comments that help, you know, uh, the channel grow in terms of, you know, maybe some critics. But it's always helpful, you know, because by the critics, you can then learn and you can improve your uh, the, the content that I upload. So thank you for all of you who have been motivating me through the videos, you know, saying that my videos have been helpful or that, uh, you know, you, you were able to enjoy them. So again, thank you, guys. Thank you for for everything. Um, and uh, I wanted to leave you uh, this very quick meditation from the Bible uh, that we can find in Proverbs. 4 chapter uh, sorry chapter 4 verse 23 that says above all, all else guard your heart for it is the wellspring of life it's a very short verse and it's like a uh, an encouragement and a motivation that the bible teaches so god wants us to guard our hearts you now when the bible talks about the heart it's not talking about the cardiac muscle so the actual like heart the muscle but it's talking about our emotions so our um, our mind right it's talking about all these different areas both the mind and the the, the part of ourselves that it's like emotion and all the stuff and here it says that above everything else that we guard of our lives we need to guard our heart and then the Bible teaches us why. So why should we guard our hearts so much? Because from it, because it's the wellspring of life. That means that every single thing that gives life into our lives, so anything that is going to make our lives better, happier, uh, uh, you know, more fun, and uh, uh, just, you know, living a better life, it because it comes from our heart so if our heart is well kept and it's in uh, it's healthy and it's in a good condition and it's strong and it's uh, peaceful and you know because we're guarding it as the bible teaches us then we're gonna have a good life because we're gonna have all the from this good heart all the good things are gonna be flowing and therefore our life is gonna be enriched and what's the drawback? Well, of course, if we don't guard it good enough, what happens is that we, our life takes a, uh, like we cannot fully enjoy it. If our heart is sick or it's depressed or it's uh, sad, then we will never be able to fully enjoy our lives. Because uh, as the Bible says here, from the heart, everything else uh, goes out. So if the root of our, you know, of our body, of our soul, it's sick, everything else is gonna also be sick, right? Exactly as a tree. If the roots are bad, then all the tree is gonna be bad. So it's very important that we guard our heart. So our, you know, our emotions, our, uh, our minds, we need to guard them. We need to, you know, keep them safe from having, uh, from having bad influences, for from watching bad things.
things or listening to bad things. We need to guard them, you know, we need to feed to our heart good food. We need to give it good things. And in that way, by keeping it healthy, we can then have a healthier and a better life. That is what the Bible teaches us. And yeah, that's just the, the very quick meditation I wanted to show you. So, um, you know, I want to share with you guys today. So again, a big thank you and God bless you. See ya.